619. Well, making it to the WNBA is a dream for many girls playing basketball all around the world. And one local athlete has made the dream a reality. James Scott has more on her story to success. Yes. Okay. Oh no. Yeah. I'm a big fan of ranch too. Right. I love me ranch too. too. Yeah. Pizza. Especially on pizza. Yeah. That made me crave pizza and ranch. Mm. Right. But, but yeah, would, would you sure. dip your pizza in that ice cream? I don't think so, no. no. If that's a good Definitely. question. You like all the condiments on your hot dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> right. I just love hot dogs. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Oh, hey, it's almost You're baseball season. Hot dog season yeah. So. Yeah. Oh, well, that'll be fun. We'll have to go, go check out a night's dog. game, get some hot dogs mm -hmm. in us. We saw us stuffing your, our faces. No, we didn't. Yeah. <laughs> no, I know. you didn't. I know, What's right? the saying? Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll move along. Coming up on Rising at 6 30, it's National Women's Month, and some local high school girls are proving that they can do anything that boys can. A closer look at the push to make flag football a new varsity sport. It's a tough one. It's March 13th. Lauren yeah. McDonald, Lauren Skilligan, Rachel Maurer, Nicole Madden, uh, Dernisa Jefferson, Emma Mondo. We got the whole crew here and uh, we just want to welcome you all to our new lovely set. Check lovely. it out. Yes. The new digs. Yes. It's making Monday feel a lot better. It right. does. Right? A lot brighter. <laughs> that's for sure. Uh, and with that, we're going to kick it over to Nicole who may not have as bright. Oh, oh you know, yeah. you just have to... Um, at the bars along the way. Yeah. <laughs> so that was perfect. Yeah. yeah, because they were kind of part of the parade as well. Looked like yeah. they were having a good old time. Oh, that's for were. sure. I was definitely shouting at that uh, section over there, and they definitely obliged. So they that was shouted nice. That. <laughs> yeah, it was fun. <laughs> it was a little bit chilly, but the sun made it feel so good. It was so yeah. bad. It actually yeah. ended up being a really nice day out there. Oh. I had my jacket on and felt really good. Eventually took that jacket off even. Uh, this morning, probably won't be taking. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Yeah. Allergy, yeah. Allergy, yeah. Allergy, allergy season is here. Good, <laughs> not hold that. We sorry, know guys. that it came three weeks early. That pollen, Excuse I'll tell you me. what. <laughs> All right, well, uh, well, coming up, a history making that. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Allergy, yeah. allergy season is here. Good, not hold that. Sorry, we know guys. that it came three weeks early. That pollen, Excuse I'll tell me. you what. <laughs> All right, well, uh, well, coming up, a history making that. Well, all right, up next, it's all about the Oscars. Did Angela Bassett throw shade at Jamie Lee Curtis? Uh, no, I saw that video. <laughs> the no silence comment. speaks volumes. There you go. There you all go. Right. <laughs> well, after the break, we're talking Oscars fashion with fashion stylist Felicia Biddle. Stay right there. Thank you. It is 8.51. Coming up, yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. These phrases, they mm. sound pretty polite, but some ladies are saying thanks, but no thanks. Next in your morning bit, Nicole, we were talking in the break. Um, and we have this in common. If you want to just right. go ahead and talk about your childhood, my, my parents. You just go first name in all caps. Like, <laughs> okay. You listen here. John. No, I'm kidding. John. <laughs> yeah. Dash. Yeah. Or, and then when you leave periods, that's when you really get right. It. Periods. No, but yeah, definitely. I think it's just kind of how you're raised and just yeah. being hey, like like versus mm -hmm. my uh, my my wife's dad. I always call him sir. Yeah. You know, and yeah. never really 